Bridget Dale here with What's New in Home Movies. In junior high and all through high school, I would turn beet red every time I had to give a speech. One time, a teacher asked me if I was choking because I was so red. Bridget, this isn't therapy. It's a movie show. Get to the point. Did you know that public speaking is the number one fear in the minds of most people? And most people don't even have a stammer. And most people don't have thousands of people hanging on their every word because they're the king of England. So you can see that a period piece about a middle-aged man trying to overcome his stutter is actually pretty exciting. Today, the king's speech hits stores on Blu-ray and DVD. The movie won four Academy Awards, including Best Picture. It's kind of a big deal. Also available today, Gulliver's Travels. Starring Jack Black, a travel writer tries to travel to Bermuda but accidentally ends up on the island of Lilliput, surrounded by little tiny people. Size jokes! Another new release today, The Way Back. I was googling information about this movie and autocorrect changed my search to The Sway Back. No, the, the Way Back. Starring Colin Farrell, Jim Sturgis, Ed Harris. The story of people that walked over 4,000 miles from Siberia to India to freedom. Much different than a Sway Back. Also out today, Somewhere. A party guy type actor has to change up his life when his 11-year-old daughter moves in with him. Directed by Sofia Coppola. And Stephen Dorff got to play a guy who isn't a horrible person for once in this movie. So that was nice. Have a good week. I'll see you next time. Wayback is really good and everything, but I want to make a movie about this. Wayback. Swayback, you must have some stories to tell.